Welcome to Hammock Hour with your host, me. As we talk about the difference between a prickle, a thorn, and a spine. So, if, you, uh, if you're if just a normal person and you see a rose, you think it has thorns. If you see a rubus, a bramble, or a raspberry, whatever you want to call it, you think these things or thorns. Oh, I got poked by thorns all the time. That's what we say. Everything's a thorn. Everything is not a thorn. Roses actually don't have thorns. So every time you sing, every rose has its it's, you're lying to yourself. Roses actually have prickles. Hawthorns actually have thorns. And cacti have spines. And we're going to go into really quickly the difference between those three. So you can feel confident in knowing that roses don't actually have the thorns, they have prickles. But let me tell you, Brett Michaels needs to, to rework some of his rhymes if he's gonna sing Every Rose Has Its Prickles. All right, so these lovely flowers have nothing to do with what I'm talking about. This is uh, a Puncia cespitosa, um, Puncia cespitosa. Maybe we'll do a video on this sometime. Uh, but what I wanna talk about is the, oh, look at that one. Look at that long spine. Look at that long spine right there. Ow! Don't touch those. So they have these little clusters. Though sometimes they have one or two big spines. Uh, there, if you can, there it is. Look at that spine. Uh, remember, a spine is a modified leaf. So this green, what you see on this prickly pear, this eastern uh, or midwestern, I don't know the common name, prickly pear. Uh, you see the green paddles is actually the stem. This is actually the stem, and then the little, the little cluster of spines little cluster of spines is the uh, is the um, uh, the the leaves the modified leaves so the modified leaves a little cluster of spines Would prickly pear be called spiny pear so now right here you can see them this is a thorn so the thorn is this modified branching structure see how it's coming off a node it's woody um, it's got the sharp point this is a critigus or a hawthorn um, and this is a true thorn it's a true thorn little critigus cruscali here and look at this look at this thorn look at that that's it see how it's on the nodes there that's a true thorn a true thorn so um unlike something like uh you know the prickles that so these are not thorns again this this is a rose uh these are prickles prickles so a prickle is just uh, really, it's just a protuberance or growth off of the epidermal tissue, so the skin tissue, um, kind of the bark tissue, or whatever you know. It's it's uh, analog analogous to, to hair. Oftentimes, it's analogous, analogous to hair. That's a word that gets stuck in my mouth. It sounds like. Anywho, uh, so you can see here that it's not growing off the nodes. It's growing in the internodes, you know, and under the nodes here, or whatever. But it's growing throughout there. Um, whereas like on a thorn, it's going to be growing within on that node where the branch would come out. So that's a prickle. It's a prickle. So what about things like the black locust? So the black locust, you have these supposed thorns that come out on the black locust. Uh, and they're not really thorns, so it's a modified stipule. And a stipule is a modified leaf. So what does that make it? Dun, 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 dun. It is a spine. It is a spine. One night it took your life. You had nothing to say. 